Hey everyone, I'm Insetic, and with me is Blank Tester. Hey kids, how's it going? And today on my extreme sports video game series, we're gonna be playing Rocket Power Team Rocket Rescue for the PlayStation One. <sighs> oh yeah, I hate Rocket Power. You get to play as the Rocket Power kids, you know, Otto, Reggie, Sam, Twister, as you do sick tricks on anything that wouldn't kill the kids to crash on. So, like, And some things that would kill the so kids. So skateboarding, BMX, inline skate, snowboarding. You want to do cool extreme sports tricks, you got it. Uh, yeah, this is going to be like four videos. It's not a very long game, and this is going to be kind of one. There's a story one. mode. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, yeah, it's kind of going to be one of those meme playthroughs where we just look at a bad game that I can beat in like an hour. So whatever, let's pick a character and jump in. Man, Raimundo, that's mega bogus. And to think I once bought a pair of shoelaces from Snowmart. I feel so guilty. Uh, don't worry about it, Twist. The way things are going, you guys will be buying all your gear from Snowmart soon. Isn't there anything we can do to help Rocket Board stay in business, Raimundo? Things are slow, and Snowmart just had their new line featured in Skate and Shred magazine. I'm afraid they're gonna put us out for good this time. Guys, we gotta do something to help save rocket boards. Save rocket boards? What are you kids talking about now? Snow Mart's putting some major heat on Dad's shop. And with no money to advertise, rocket boards is as good as gone. Hmm. Sound like rocket boards need some publicity. Hey. Now, if you enter Ocean Shore's tri event competition and ride for rocket boards, Ramundo will get more publicity than you could shake a snake at! Good idea! Yeah! So sweet! But you're gonna have to win every event. Now you can practice here at Mount Town, and I may even be able to teach you the Super MacVarial 900. You guys ready to save rocket boards and bust no more out of the water? Yeah! All right! Let's do it! Cool! No, your computer's not lagging. That cutscene was at like 10 FPS. I gotta say, it's really upsetting <laughs> to me how ambitious they were with the cutscenes. I loved the mouths, how they were just painted on. But that's like, that takes so much more effort than just not doing that. Like, just don't yeah. zoom in and we wouldn't see their mouths anyways. <laughs> Maybe just don't show video so we didn't have to see that anyways. Maybe don't include a story <laughs> mode. Like, no, I did, love did, how th did kids watch Did kids watch Rocket Power for the plot? Excuse me, bro. I personally run the Rocket Power wiki, where I in-depth analyze every single episode. Ah, uh, okay. I also love oh how the God. kids couldn't have thought about, you know, joining the competition on their own. Yeah. Like, no. But yeah, all right, first event, snowboarding, and it's really just controls, you know. Push up on the D-pad, push left and right on the D-pad, and it's actually kind of tough. The snowboarding and the, really the movement in this game ain't that great. Uh, Is it, so it doesn't allow analog inputs? I'm trying to remember. I, I think it might have, but I think I had some real trouble with it. Oh, yeah, Who are you but, even playing as? Uh, Twister. I picked Twister for the first set. Why? Uh, uh... He was at the bottom of the list. He deserves to be at the bottom of the list. <laughs> I wanted to give love to everyone. He's the know? worst character. Hey, come on, man. That's fighting words. He's the worst character because he he gets constantly cucked by, by, by Otto on his skateboard. Because he's like, hey, Otto... I can do tricks too. Yeah, that's cool. Make sure the camera's in focus. Like, oh, what an shit. ass wipe. Whoa, hold up. Before we can go to the cool event, the Snowmart team broke our bike and hid the parts. So what we have to go. <laughs> we have to go find the parts so we're not disqualified. So no, no cutscene for that. No, no, the cutscene's just at the start of the sets. You see, there were three levels, and actually four levels, because there's always one of these intermissions, but, oh man, I have got to say, I looked at other people playing this game on YouTube, 
and anyone who's just playing it through live gets wrecked by this level. Because A, you've never been there before. That's true. B, these parts are actually kind of hard to find. So, like, no one I've seen spends less than, like, ten minutes on this level. Is there a timer? Oh, God. Yes, yeah. There's a timer of, like, a minute 40, and you've got to go around it. And you know what the sad thing is? This is the only time you go to this level in campaign mode. Now, of course, you unlock all the levels for free ride, but, like, in free ride, you can get on the roller coaster and go up to the top, and there's, like, a special power up there. There's cool shit around. There's cool stuff around. But they've got these levels where sometimes their only purpose is to be these intermission levels. Oh my god, there's so many parts. <laughs> yeah, six parts, and some of them are kind of hidden pretty hard. Like, I know where they are. This ain't my first go-around. This ain't my first rodeo. The handlebars, I, w I don't think I would have ever seen them. Yeah, yeah. So, what's the part that people seem to have the most trouble with? Well, I guess... Uh, all of them, pretty much. But... Especially one that's actually kind of up on the roofs. Oh god, the triangle? Uh, yeah. Yeah, like the frame. Yeah. Like, I don't know, it's just not something you're expecting. And it's a small time limit when you don't know the level. Oh my god. The level's and you can jump pretty over complicated. It. <laughs> yeah. So, alright, we got some sick inline skating action, just because our board was broken. Did his hand just go or through his broken. sleeve? Hey man, when you're Twister Rodriguez, you can do stuff like that, alright? They Post made this game! Post in the comments what your favorite Rocket Power character was. And if it's Twister, then get in an argument with Blank Tester. If you name any Rocket Power character, <laughs> I'm gonna be upset. Because uh, Rocket Power was a garbage show. <laughs> hey man, Rocket Power Every character Power was, was great. stupid and bad. Hey man, it, uh, it's not my fault that there were no kid shows. Like, I don't know, dedicated to the excitement of, like, solving Fermat's theorems or any of that you know shit what? like that. You know, I remember when I was a kid, there was this there was this one episode that really pissed me off. Where <laughs> Otto is doing some kind of, like, street luge thing, and he cheats. Uh, he cheats, and, like, everybody gets pissed off at him. And they're like, Otto, how could you? And, like, the thing that pissed me off about the episode was that, like, they cheat in, like, almost every episode. <laughs> Hey, man. They cheat uh, at whatever sport they're doing all the time. And yeah, nobody calls well, them out on it. And now the show has the audacity to tell you. Oh, all right. So here's uh, the special thing about this game, and that is the special meter. What when you do fuck? sick tricks, you fill up that meter. And then when it's full, or actually whenever, but, you know, when it's full, you have the whole meter. You hit the triangle button, and your guy literally just stops in midair. And you could start doing as many tricks as you want before that meter runs out. And so that means, you know, you can use the face buttons to do tricks, or you can spin with L2 and R2, or you can flip with L1 and R1. And you can just build up this ridiculous looking series of moves and get like tens of thousands of points. What? Yeah. I don't know. Is does that does that special meter extend the timer at all? No. Okay. But there are special clock pickups you can find. In well, I mean, like if you're the in the middle of your special, while you're while the timer has hit zero, will it just end it with you in the air, or do you have to be on the ground? When the timer hits zero, you will drop out of your special mode towards the ground. It does okay. not let you stay in the air for an extra five seconds if you have the meter filled up. That would be neat, I guess. Pie Piston. Sputz Sp Ringley. I think yeah. if my name was Sputz... <laughs> I mean... I think know, I don't even can... have to finish that sentence. <laughs> this, this one goes out to all the Sputz out there. Oh, man. Yo, dog. To every Sputz out there, I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, but now we're going to Mad Town to do some sick skating action. Mad Town races, sing this song, do da, do da. Whatever. Damn man. this music though. Yeah. So yeah, timer increased by like five seconds, and uh, those lightning bolt pickups you see, 
Like, I think speed you up, and do they increase your special? I think they I'm give you your special. No, maybe not. No, just just speed you up. Um, and then I thought there last are... level they were. They were or maybe I was just busting so. But there are also some pickups that will completely fill those stars that will completely fill your special meter. And, wow. You know, immediately. And also, it'll put some words on your screen. I'm trying to remember what they were. I played this game like a month ago. Okay. Like I recorded wow, it with what? toast. Yeah, it says toast, and despite the fact usually that means a bad thing, here it means you get your full special meter. Cause you're cooked. Yeah, I guess so. But you know what the crazy thing is? I'm not cheating by doing this. The game expects you to get sixty thousand points with a full special meter thing. Like, the high scores yeah. are gonna start becoming 200,000, 300,000. I'm not exploiting a baby's game to smack the competition. I'm actually... Playing it the way it's intended. Playing the way it's intended. Now, I don't think going up rails by mashing the grind button was intended, but... Toast! <laughs> Toast. And oh yeah, secret character unlock. Who was that? Uh, God, who was it? We'll see I've got a bonus. Yeah, I've got a bonus video where I point these things out. Oh my god, you're on fire. Ooh, 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 I'm on fire. Bruce oh. Springsteen and Rocket Power, that's a combination that you'll only see on the Aesthetic channel. <sighs> I just made my dad and, um... Someone else happy. Who's happy that I'm playing Rocket Power games? Leave a like in the comments if you're happy. Leave I'm playing a Rocket like Power. in the comments. <laughs> yeah. He's been doing this YouTube thing for years <laughs> and he still doesn't get it. Oh, you want to know the stupid thing about flipping and spinning? Let's what say is... you go for a flip, but you only get halfway around before you hit another spin or flip input. The game oh. will remember your position as being upside down. And, like, basically reset when it goes to do another spin. So let's say you do half a flip and then spin. Now you're upside down. And you gotta think, okay, I gotta do another spin and get right side up. Oh and my then either, gosh. And then either land or, or do another flip and get right side up. Or then cancel that input then. So and you gotta do another flip, then cancel your input halfway through and do, like, a spin or something. Right, right. Oh the game God. doesn't just... You know, one push of the button equals a 360. It doesn't do that. It does like it. It, it, it launches the process of turning you 360 degrees. Right. Oh. All geez. right. So that was the first set of levels in Rocket Power. So when we come back, we'll see the kids' progress in this cool tournament and saving their dad's skate shop. Yeah.